What's up everyone, Apple Orchard here, and today Apple has released macOS Sonoma 14.3. In this video, I'll be showing you what is new inside the software. The first thing is inside of system settings. So if we were to go into here and then go into general, we have a couple of changes inside of Apple Care Warranty. The first thing is it has been rebranded from coverage to Apple Care and Warranty. Uh, upon going in here, you'll be able to change a couple of more settings in here. The first thing is you're able to renew your Apple Care Plus if you have it. For example, on this iPad, I can renew this Apple Care if I wanted to. This is a pretty cool feature to have inside of macOS Sonoma 14.3. Now the next change is inside of the music app. So we have a new feature called Collaborative Playlist. It works pretty similar on how it does in iOS with a couple of minor changes. So I'll have this little playlist right here and you can collaborate with it. And if I were to share the invite link, I will leave that down in the description down below if you would like to add songs to it. And I want to see your taste of music. And then you could also react to songs. So for example, if I wanted to react to this song, I could just play it right here. And then you're going to see this new icon up here. This is for reactions. So you have thumbs up, heart, party, fire, dislike, and heartbreak. But you could also add any emoji you want. And this is a pretty cool feature inside of macOS 14.3, which is also in iOS 17.3 as well. If you have Apple Music and macOS 14.3, please be sure to get the playlist. Here's a QR code for it if you'd like to join inside of iOS 17.3. But please add songs if you can. I want to know your taste of music. And right here is my favorite song, so that's why I added it to this playlist. macOS 14.3 is a relatively small update, but I do have updates coming to StudyDirect and Wikipedia. So most of these widgets right here, at least these ones right here, you can find down in the description down below. And StudyDirect is a studying app which is 100% free, but now I'm going to be done advertising. Since this video is pretty short, we're going to be talking about what we could expect inside of macOS 14.4. The beta could either come either sometime this week or sometime in the next couple of weeks. We don't know when it's going to be released. It's probably dependent on how Apple is doing with it. And the first major feature inside of macOS 14.4 is what we can expect is some brand new emojis. So if I were to bring the emoji picker right here, we have a couple of brand new emojis coming and this is the update where we can expect some brand new emojis and then there are going to be a couple other significant changes inside of macOS right here. Maybe we'll get bug fixes to the clock app since it is a little bit buggy right now. We don't have stolen device protection here because you do need an actual password or your fingerprint. And most people are going to do Touch ID. And people don't really know how to look at people typing on their MacBook. So I really don't see the point inside of stolen device protection on the Mac. But it could come, who knows. Who cares really? But yeah, relatively small video. Thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, share it with your friends, download my apps down in the description down below, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!